hello welcome back to my channel if you're new you're welcome and i hope you stay today i'm going to show you how i cut my vegetables for specific uses without wasting time let's just get started if i need to be cutting vegetables i obviously need a good knife and there is no better knife than this nakano's santoku knife this is high quality durable and it is handmade in japan if you want to check out the nakano knives i have a link in the description box and there's a link pinned to the first comments you can check it out they have so many good knives so many options for your everyday needs well, i'll start by cutting my cabbage um this is how i cut my cabbage when i need to make some coleslaw or some cabbage salad in general I like to cut them very thin. Next, I'm going to cut some carrots and this is how I cut them if I want to fry them in oil before using them for my favorite sauce. I also use this method if I have to make some fried rice because it becomes so tiny and it's easier to eat especially for kids. Next, if I want to serve kids some carrots, this is how I cut them. It is easier to munch on and it does not choke them up. So basically, if you want carrots for a snack, which is healthier, it's better to cut them this way. next if i want to put them in my favorite stews or soups this is how i cut them i like to cut them in this disc shape and basically i put them in the stew or soup about two minutes before it is ready i don't need to overcook them next this is how i like to cut my onions for my salads or sandwiches now it's thinner and i prefer the semicircle shape This is how I chop my onions when I have to fry it in oil before my favorite stew or sauce. Put them into smaller pieces and when I fry them, it kind of uh, melts in the oil and it doesn't leave any chunks in the stews, especially if you have to serve it to kids. You know, kids don't like, you know, to find onions in their food. When I need to make some onion rings, this is how I cut them. As you can see, it is thicker than the one I cut first. I also use these rings in decorating meat or other foods.
and finally if i have to throw some onions into my stew that is two or three minutes before the stew is ready i just cut them into these big chunks basically yeah this is how i cut my vegetables so let me know do you cut them into any other shape which one of these is your favorite if you want to check out the nakano knives i have a link in the description box and there's a link pinned to the first comments you can check it out they have so many good knives so many options for your everyday needs if you've not subscribed please don't forget to hit the subscribe button don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up until next time i am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one bye bye